Kansas City Chiefs on the road again today, playing divisional rival the Denver Broncos. And the Chiefs had success on every phase of the game, offense, defense, and special teams. Kansas City Chiefs playing in their first snow game of the season. We will start in the first quarter of the game, and the Chiefs are driving. They hand it to rookie running back Clyde edwards alaire and he's able to break through a couple of tackles. He rumbles his way into the end zone for the first touchdown of the game. Now on the next drive for the Broncos, Mizzou alum and Lee Summit native Drew Locke with some good deception, pulls the ball on a quarterback run and is able to get into the end zone with ease. The Broncos are on the board, staying in the first quarter. Patrick Mahomes hands it off to new running back Le'Veon Bell showing some good moves. Nice run for Le'Veon Bell. That's a good sign for the Chiefs offense. To the second quarter, the Broncos are trying to get something going here. Drew Locke throws an interception to Dirty Dan, the man Dan Sorensen, picks off Locke and takes it the other way for pick six. Drew Locke wishes he had that one back, staying in the second quarter. Here is the major turning point in the game. The Broncos take it to Byron Pringle, who takes it out of the end zone, breaks a couple of tackles, puts his foot in the ground, and takes it the distance. Shout out to K-State. Big return for Byron Pringle to the fourth, where the Broncos are trying to get something going. It's an interception, and it's Tyron Matthew, the Honey Badger, with the interception. The Chiefs defense forced four turnovers in the game. The Chiefs back with the football. Mahomes tosses it out to Tyree Kill. He breaks the tackle and is able to score. Patrick Mahomes keeps his streak alive. 17 consecutive games throwing a touchdown. The Chiefs are able to beat the Denver Broncos 43-16. to That's 10 straight times that the Chiefs have beat the Broncos. Here are the Chiefs after the big win. Nice that we'll be able to go out there and win in several different ways. And I think we kind of found our footing on that at the end of last year. And it's kind of continuing this, this year. And, uh, uh, we, we kind of feel the temperature of the game, offense, defense, and special teams. And, and obviously, we want to score every drive, but uh, it's not there. And the defense is playing like it's playing today. Uh, don't don't make anything worse and just can, just punt and let the, uh, the special teams work and then let the defense go out there and make plays. Uh, once I seen the hole break uh, open up, I just ran through with power. And I knew I had two dudes backside to, to make miss. And once I made a miss, I just ran to the touchdown, but I wasn't looking back. Got a long season ahead of us. Got some big games coming up, um, and it's going to really prove who we are, you know, as a defense. So I'm um, just looking forward to us stepping up, coming to work, you know, each and every day, you know, with that energy, that attitude, you know, and just, just, just wanting to have fun, you know, wanting to play hard for the guy next to you. So the Chiefs remain number one in the AFC West and will return home for back-to-back -back home games, hosting the New York Jets and the Carolina Panthers.